Hey everyone, this is Johnny and I'm on the Canary Islands going to Florida right now. It's gonna take me three days to get there. But I'm going for a Tony Robbins Date with Destiny event. Uh, you can see right here, I'm starting at the beach and then I'm hopping on a plane to Lisbon, Portugal. Let's start the journey. All right, so I just got to the airport and checked my bag. There's 23 kilos, which is like 50, is it 50 pounds? I don't know, 40, 40 pounds, it's pretty heavy. Um, so I'm glad they let me check it directly to Miami, even though I have a 10 hour layover in Lisbon about to uh, see if I can get to the lounge. All right, so I am finally about aboard after a two hour delay. So luckily that priority pass worked and I was able to use the lounge for a few hours. So now I am going to board the plane to Lisbon where I'm gonna spend the night at a hostel before flying out to Miami. Alright guys, so I made it to Lisbon in Portugal and I'm here for one night. So I just went from like really hot sunny weather which was 30 Celsius almost which is probably like 85, 90 to 15 degrees Celsius which is like, I think it's what, 50 something degrees so it's freezing right now but it's a beautiful city. I just have one night here back to the airport. Alright so I'm at the airport now but this is crazy long immigration line so who knows how long it's will take. All right, so it was a one hour and 10 minute wait in immigration, it was insane, but I got through easily smoothly and I'm about to get on the plane right now. Next stop, Miami. All right, so after a nine and a half hour flight, we are in Miami. Oh, I guess this is me. I'm in Miami. So I'm excited to be here and make it all the way from the Canaries. All right. Alright, so I probably should have done this in the beginning of the video for the people who haven't been following my blog or you haven't read my blog post called Why I Am Attending Date With Destiny with Tony Robbins. But now that I'm here and I've actually had a full night's sleep, I wanted to just kind of quickly talk about why I did this crazy journey and spent all this money to come here even though my life seems like it's pretty good on paper. You know, like I've been traveling for years now full-time I, I can work online i make a pretty good salary or a pretty good amount of money online with my online businesses and it seems like i have a great life well i think what it is is i'm at this point in, in my life where i'm like okay well is this it you know do i have all the answers and do i know what i should be doing you know and i just for some reason don't do it or is there something really stopping me from just really achieving more so there's actually a quote on my arm that a lot of people have never really asked about, but it's a quote by William, Williamson. Williamson. Uh, I'll put it on the screen here so you guys can read it. But it basically, it's the first two lines of her quote, talking about how our deepest fear isn't that we are inadequate or that we're not good enough or we can't do it. It's actually that we are powerful beyond measure. And what that means is we have so much potential. There's so many things that we can do in life that we sometimes don't want that obligation of doing it. We don't, you know, we don't want to set ourselves up to fail. We don't want to try and then risk, you know, losing whatever it is and whether that just be time or money or our ego, um, you know, or even just do everything for, for nothing. And I think at Tony Robbins conference, I date with destiny. My goal is really just to force myself to spend six days with other like-minded people who want to figure out want to you know want to figure out their goals want to figure out what's possible figure out what's holding us back and really just force ourselves to do the things that we know we should do anyways like writing down goals thinking about what is really important in life so i'm excited to meet all of you if you're going to be at the conference please come up to me say hi just come up just give me a hug and you can tell me who you are later uh, if you see me somewhere else in the world if you're not going to the conference you know, come say hi or leave a comment so I can follow your story as well. And hopefully we'll get all get a lot out of this journey. I'll see you guys. Bye.